Welcome to Foxtech. If you're looking for a better keyboard experience on your iPhone, Google's Gboard might be exactly what you need. It's an alternative to the default iOS keyboard, offering extra features like glide typing, built-in Google search, and easy access to GIFs. Here's how to set it up and start using it. First, you'll need to download Gboard from the App Store. Just search for Gboard and install it like any other app. Once it's installed, you have to enable it in your iPhone settings. Open settings, go to general, then keyboard and tap keyboards. Select add new keyboard and choose Gboard from the list. After adding Gboard, you need to grant it full access. This is necessary for some of its key features to work properly. In the keyboard list, tap Gboard, then toggle on allow full access. This lets it use advanced functions like Google search and GIF suggestions while typing. Now that it's set up, switching to Gboard is simple. Whenever you're typing, press and hold the globe icon on the keyboard. A list of available keyboards will pop up. Just tap Gboard to switch. From this point on, it will function as your default keyboard until you change it again. To get the most out of Gboard, open the Gboard app and explore the customization options. You can change the theme, adjust autocorrect settings, enable glide typing, and fine tune other preferences to match how you like to type. One of Gboard's standout features is the built-in Google search. When using Gboard, you'll see a G button on the keyboard. Tapping this lets you search Google directly without leaving the app you're in. You can also use it to find and send GIFs, emojis, and even quick responses, making messaging more convenient. That's all you need to start using Gboard on your iPhone. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to Foxtech for more iPhone tips. Thanks for watching and see you later.